everyone, welcome back to a vintage vanity, and today it's tea time. Mm -hmm. We've got some scandalous things to talk about. What? That was my attempt to look mysterious. Did it work? I hope it did. All right, first off, I have to thank you guys so, so much for really sticking with me and all your support and your love and your encouragement and well wishes over the last two and a half months because, as you guys are aware, my mom had been in rehab for a fractured knee and with all her other health problems it's just it's taken her this long to actually come home she just came home last saturday and she's doing really well she's adjusting super well couldn't be happier but as you can imagine this just something like this just ripples out into every aspect of your life and um you know you just you just ride those ripples and you do what you can do and you know, having, having you guys there to support me and like inquire and just like your comments, you've no idea what it's meant. It, it has really kind of kept me going through the parts that were really, 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 really hard. So thank you guys so much. So with that, let's get to the scandal because, you know, I have been toying with this for a while and y'all are probably going to laugh at me for like, you're going to be like, Jen, not a big deal or like Jen we already guessed that but and some of you maybe might it might turn some of you guys off and you might be like unsubscribe and I hope you don't but I would understand it if you did I know now you guys are like do tell come on already and I'm probably like I said bigger deal than it probably is and I want to talk about age yeah yeah, it is a really hard, I, I, hard thing to to be on YouTube, especially, but in then add into that like the hair beauty type lifestyle world, and um, you know, mostly full of like twenty and early thirty year olds, and guess what, guys? That's not me. I actually am older than that. I hopefully am older than any of you guys actually expected. Um, and I can't, see, this is the thing, is I'm like, I went back and forth on this. I went back and forth on this, and I'm still like, I'm not going to say the actual number. There's something about, like, saying the actual number. Like, I cannot physically do it. But I will tell you this, I am in my 40s. Right? I, you know, and uh, right? Not that big of a deal. Every, everybody ages. And that's the thing is I struggled with that. Like, should I say, because in one aspect, I felt like I wasn't doing um, you guys justice by not talking about that because there are certain like beauty type of things that come along once your skin starts to get older. And why not talk about that? And why am I hiding that when I think it would be a good thing to be like, hey guys, you can be who you're going to be at any age of your life. It doesn't mean when you hit like 30s, your life stops. Or if you hit 30 and these things haven't happened, your life stops. Or you didn't succeed. Or you're going to get a failing grade on your report card. It, it doesn't matter. I mean, life is just life. And age is just a number we put to the time we've been on this earth truly means nothing other than human beings want to track the passage of of our lives and um i think staying healthy and staying vibrant and staying with goals and achievements in your life that's what's important and that's the the things that are going to keep you from becoming old I think and especially like um, looking around because um, me being older and um, I think I'm, I, this is going back quite a while so there might not be very many of you that know this but I was I adopted as a child as a baby just a wee baby and I was adopted to parents that were a little bit on the older side so I'm going through things that none of my friends um, have actually gone through yet, which is why it's been so amazing to share a lot of this with you guys because so many of you have given me information. So many of you have shared stories with whether it be your parents or your grandparents and you have no, I, okay, I'm gonna tear up. You have no idea how much it has actually helped me to get all that feedback from you guys and 
it's just it's just been immensely 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 that's not even a word it's been really helpful and the links and information you've sent me so um huh so yeah it's out there i said it on the internet my age ish um, and I really, I really hope that everybody is okay with that. I mean, I don't, it doesn't change who I am or, or what I do. I hope you don't think it's weird that somebody in their forties has pink hair. Cause guess what? I don't, <laughs> I think it's fabulous. And I want to embrace everything that it is that I want to do in my life. And I want you guys along for that journey. And, um, it's just a weird thing, especially as a woman, the older you get, it's like, we have to pretend to be younger. And I'm sure it is with guys as well. You know, you want to be seen as younger. Um, and it's not so much that we want to go back. Cause I can tell you this, the more I have aged in my life, the more I have liked who I am. Like 40 something year old me, I don't think would actually like 21 year old me. I think I would have thought she was a little, I don't know, a little much. I'm going to say just a little much. Um, and I fully appreciated everything that's come with every passing year and every learning experience. And um, I do feel wiser, <laughs> you know, um, and I cherish every moment that's gotten me to where I am. And I look forward to what the next 40 some years has to offer me as well. Uh, I really want to hear your thoughts on aging and how you put what, what your own insecurities that you put into your age is and um, how you handle that. Let me know in the comment section below because I, I think it's a lot easier now that we have actresses that are starting to represent women that are staying glamorous into their older years. Um, that seems so weird to say, <laughs> but the funny thing is I think the next thing I have to look forward to is like the senior discount at like 63. <laughs> You know, it's just, I don't know. It's like we rush through life trying to get to milestone and after milestone. And instead of saying, I am here, this is where I am. This is who I am. And I'm just going to be in this moment. And I'm really, really trying to be in that moment. And I wanted to let you into that moment and say, this is where I am right now. And if you have already been here, you know, um, I look forward to being where you are. If you are here now, I want to share that that feeling of being here. And if you're not here yet, I want to say it's okay. Because when you get here, it's fine. I don't know how to end this tea time. I really don't. I hope you guys have really enjoyed it. And um, Was it scandalous even? Did I even surprise you guys? I feel like maybe I didn't. Maybe this was all just a big deal in my head. I don't know, but let me know. I really am interested to hear what you guys have to say in the comment section below. And I guess as a final wrap up, just embrace, <laughs> embrace it, right? Mm. Um, real quick though, I do want to say for those of you that will be attending Viva, please find me and stop me at any point that you see me and say hi. Keep in mind, I am deaf in one ear, so I am very hard of hearing. So, you know, if you need to run up, tap me on the shoulder, whatever you need to do. I do want to see you guys. The other thing is, um, I am going to do an official meetup, um, <laughs> I know um, at the Miss Elfire booth at the car show on Saturday from 2 to 3. And the first 25 people there will get an extra special treat. The rest of you will get just extra special hugs. I hope you guys have a great day and I will see you soon. Bye. Today's hair tutorial is this. I wanted to do a look that required absolutely, positively, no back combing or teasing. So I took my inspiration from some of the